Hey guys, welcome back. You didn't think I was really leaving, did you? I hope not. We're just upgrading. Welcome to the new and improved Idle Garage. Look how fancy this door is. Let's see what's behind it. whole lot of junk but hey look at the space we have for all this junk let's take a look around well with trying to tell you about my garage first things first mm, these are the only lights I have so it's really hard to film much of it so let me just tell you about it instead it is a 28 by 28 with an upstairs the upstairs is attic trusses I do have steps that go up to that Right now that's serving as storage, but eventually I'd like to try to turn that into a usable space like a wood shop kind of area of the garage. In addition to that being the light system, this is currently the storage. So first things I need to address with the new garage is get some lights so you guys can see what happens and get all this stuff off the floor so we can use it to build things. Speaking of storage, you're going to be along for the ride on that. As soon as I get some lighting squared away so we can see, this whole wall is going to become cabinets and toolboxes. So we should be able to take all this stuff on the floor, put it away, clean up some room here so we have room to work. One of the other things that I want to address in the new garage is some ventilation. I have three of these furnace blowers that came out of construction jobs that, hey, they're tearing them down, grab the furnace blower. So, that should provide really good exhaust ventilation if we're running something in here, painting, etc. So I'm excited to get those integrated in and cleaning the air out of the garage. There's a lot of tools that I have that I've never been able to utilize and you guys have never seen, primarily because they're big, they're fixed machines that I've never had space for before. Over here underneath the steps to the corner is where I want to try and make a home for all those. Maybe just have them on stand so we can pull them out and push them back in. But, I mean, I have two van saws that I've never utilized because I didn't have the space for. So, in the future, we're going to get that all cleaned up. Right now, there is still a lot of building construction things because I am still in the midst of building the house. So, there's windows, doors, bathtub, and I'm kind of stuck with those until we get those installed. But, eventually, we are going that direction with those. This is my dream garage, and it's the new home of the Idol Garage. We got a lot more to do here with it, with getting it set up. This is where I ask for your opinion, and I always do that with a little worry. What are your thoughts on anything that maybe we should integrate into the new shop? Right now it's a blank slate, so we can make whatever changes and implement anything within reason. I still have to pay for it. So let me know in the comments what you think on that. Well, I'm off to go find some lights and round up some other materials to get started, so we'll see you soon.